Hi guys and welcome to our first video weather. On this channel we cover physics, chemistry, biology and math syllabus for IGCSEs and A levels. Today we'll talk about living things. What is biology? Biology is the study of life and living organisms. One term that is commonly used in biology is the term metabolism. But what does it mean? Metabolism is a term that is used to describe all the chemical reactions that keep a cell alive. How can you tell if something is alive or not? There are seven characteristics that must be met in everything so that we can classify it as a living organism. These seven characteristics include movement, respiration, sensitivity, growth, reproduction, excretion, and last but not least, nutrition. We can make a mnemonic for them and call it Mrs. Grin. Here is an easy way to memorize them. So M is for movement, R is for respiration, S is for sensitivity, ETC. Movement. Movement is an action by an organism or a part of an organism causing a change in position. Example. Animals move to hunt. Hunting is nutrition, which is a process that we'll talk about later. A plant moves towards light. Respiration. Respiration is a chemical reaction in which a nutrient, which is glucose, is broken down to release energy for metabolism. The form of respiration that gives us the most energy uses oxygen. It is called aerobic respiration. We'll get to that later in next videos. Sensitivity. Sensitivity is the ability to detect changes in the internal or external environment and make appropriate responses to these changes. These changes are called stimuli. Growth is a permanent increase in a cell size and dry mass. This increase is a result of an increase in the cell's number, size, or both. So if a cell absorbed water, it will become turgid, so it will increase in size. This increase is not permanent, so we can't call this increase growth as it is temporary because the cell will use that water or lose it to the surrounding. Reproduction. Reproduction involves making more of the same kind of the organism. It can happen when an organism splits or it may involve more complex processes like fertilization. Organisms that split are mostly unicellular organisms. Reproduction is not important for an individual because me as an individual can survive without reproduction. But it is important for the species because if humans did not reproduce, their species will get extinct. Excretion. Excretion is the process of getting rid of metabolic waste. Carbon dioxide is a metabolic waste that is made as a product of respiration. Nutrition. Nutrition is the process of obtaining materials for growth, development, and energy. Thank you for listening. Hope you have a great day today, and see you all next time.